Hello friends, this is Rohit Gupta. In this video, I'll going to show you how to create a relation database on AWS Cloud. For that, go under the database services and click on relation database service. Now click on instances. launch tv instance since i am running a free tech account so just make sure you are not going to uh, incur any charges so i click on it only uh, enable option eligible for all free tier usage okay so now i'm selecting mysql hit next this is the default configuration which comes under free tier choose your id okay click next this is a default vpc selected for this reason yes I make it a public accessible for my training purpose choose existing VPC so I have already a VPC configured into this region so I choose it database name I have to provide which can be like MySQL RDS kind of teachable, no preference, monitoring, don't want to enable. Okay, launch DB instance, just click on it's pretty simple. So uh, instances in under the creation. Okay. What else we can see under this window? We have CloudWatch, which will monitor the rest of the um, the services like uh, CPU, how much DB is connection is there memory storage iops okay so it's important uh, we'll need it to connect to this database i guess once the db is created we will be able to see it click on this right now it's creating it's taking time Now I can see it's still has changed from creating to backup. Let me pause this video. Okay, so now I can see like the status is available. That means we can see our newly created MySQL database and we will have the endpoint URL which we will require to connect just copy this we will connect it through MySQL workbench click on the new connection and 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 and, and connection is RDS okay Copy this over here. Okay. Okay. 
just check that connection is able to establish between your workbench and the uh, RDS so we can see in this demo box like MySQL workbench successfully made the MySQL connection okay click OK okay click on it okay so we got the window of our newly created mysql let's see how many databases under the this new sql we have window db mysql rds this is one which we have created under this use mysql rds okay we are in the mysql Let's create a new table. Okay, so do we have any tables? So we don't have any table as such created, right? So let's create a new table. Create table. Okay, test. Array end. Bracket Okay, so our table is created Okay, test table is created. Let's insert new um, values. Value inserted. So let us draw from test. Okay, so we can see we have one row added. So this is how we can create a new um, RDS MySQL database. And we have also seen how to connect to the, the newly created RDS database through MySQL Workbench. Thank you so much for watching this video.